Mayday Network is a network of companies who are committed to uh, reducing carbon uh, emissions and carbon footprint and tackling climate change. We ask people to sign up and to commit themselves over a period of time to drive down carbon footprint and contribute to this wider issue of climate change within, within Wales and within the UK. The summit is uh, very much along the lines of trying to bring people together, really to start thrashing out some of the issues that we need to take forward to help tackle climate change. What are the policy requirements within the Welsh Assembly Government? What are the messages we should be presenting to uh, businesses to help reduce their carbon footprint and be more aware of climate change? We've had uh, some inspirational speakers, I think. We invited Sony Juniper, uh, who's a writer and a thinker, and he was the ex-head of uh, Friends of the Earth, and he's advising Prince Charles on this issue, really telling us what the problems are, what the challenges are in terms of environmental impact. And if we don't do things differently, uh, we can have a very, very different environment, very, very different society in the future. But we've also had speakers from the world of business, so Graham Yorkston from the Principality Building Society, giving his view that economic development is not uh, is not mutually exclusive from environmental sustainability. You can have both. I think that if you look at the climate change agenda, it's a very big and scary agenda. And I think what principality does and what a lot of other businesses need to do is just begin taking some small steps. I think the great thing about the May Day Summit is that you meet people from other businesses and share and pick up great ideas. Uh, everyone is on a different stage of this journey when it comes to addressing climate change and no one feels oh gosh I haven't done enough. Quite often on large events like this is that you meet such interesting people but you only have a snippet of conversations so so my idea of the workshop was how do we actually get people to exchange those ideas and agree to collaborate and the format we used was a mechanism whereby we got people to reflect on an idea that they were prepared to share with other organisations and it was really important that it was something they'd already done and something that was working for them that they could describe and so what we asked them to do then was to collaborate further with the person to talk about how do I make this into a reality what things could I do that will make it so much easier for me to implement it than perhaps some of the experience you had when you went through it the first time round. I think the big message today is that it's never too late to start. The important thing is to make a start. We heard from the Youth Climate Change Champion who's given us 11 tips of things we can do like today as individuals and each of those little actions will make a difference. I, I think you need catalysts in any sort of activity and you need organisations that can facilitate discussions, get groups of people together and I think business in the community are ideally placed to act as that catalyst to bring organisations together of all shapes and sizes from across Wales. The fact that the May Day Network has now run for five years is a really good example of it still needed just simply by the fact that people give up their time in their diaries to actually come and talk about this stuff and it's actually other business people that you're speaking to as well as other organisations but it means you have a story that you can take back that says yeah, yeah you might think it's difficult but actually when I spoke to this business they said they did it this way and this is the results they delivered.